Please, everybody, now where's my map? Come on. Sir. Thank you. God, it's a barren, featureless desert out there, isn't it? <laughs> the other side, sir. <laughs> What's up, YouTube? Mr. Boy JP is on the keys and his two ease about the video today. And we have Black Adder, something that I know a lot of you have wanted me to watch and I haven't for some, for whatever. I don't even know what reason. I'm not going to explain to you, but I don't, I, I can't understand why, but I figured I'd start with a little clip first before I get myself really into the series again. Um, I got, I got a whole lot of stuff I got to do on daily motion. I did not forget daily motion is I'm just trying to make sure I'm getting the schoolwork done. But I'm not forgetting everything else. But definitely, I appreciate y'all for the support. You know what I mean? And this is a uh, Advanced World War One Tactics with General Melchett. This is the same show that has the same guy that played Mr. Bean, Rowan Atkinson. I remember the last time I made a video on him, I thought that he passed away. That might have been the most embarrassing thing I've ever posted. <laughs> wow. Field Marshal Haig has formulated a brilliant new tactical plan to ensure final victory in the field. Ah. Well, this brilliant plan involve us climbing out of our trenches and walking very slowly towards the enemy, sir. <laughs> How could you possibly know that, Blackadder? It's classified information. <laughs> <laughs> it's just funny to hear him talk because I'm just so used to seeing him not and Mr. Bean just... Mm, 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 mm. You know, you know how you know how the little when he does the motion with his mouth and then he starts, mm, mm, but he just acts like he's mute. Like I'm just not used to hearing his voice. <laughs> it's the same plan that we used last time, and the 17 times before that. E e exactly, and that is what is so brilliant about it. <laughs> it will catch the watchful Han totally off guard. Doing precisely what we've done 18 times before is exactly the last thing they'll expect us to do this time. Right, right, facts. There is, however, one small problem. That everyone always gets slaughtered in the first 10 seconds. <laughs> That's right. And Field Marshal Haig is worried that this may be depressing the men attached. Mm. He's looking to find a way Re to cheer them. What, this is damaging for troop morale? Really? <laughs> Come up. Well, his resignation and suicide would seem the only <laughs> Oh, wow. Interesting thought. Make a note of it, darling. The healthy humor of the honest Tommy. <laughs> Don't yeah, worry, my boy. Them on the if you should falter, head. remember that Captain Darling and I are behind you. About 35 miles behind you. <laughs> well, you know what this means? If it's true, sir, we'll have to cancel the push. Exactly. Damn. What a nuisance. <laughs> exactly what the enemy would expect us to do, and therefore exactly what we shan't do. Ah, now... If I... we attack where the line is strongest, then Fritz will think that our reconnaissance is a total shambles. This... Facts, it's a, it's a decoy. Because we got a bluff. It's like a Trojan horse. <laughs> <laughs> will lull him into a sense of full security. And then next week, we can attack where the lion is actually badly defended and win the greatest victory since the Winchester flower arranging team beat Harrow by 12 saw bottoms to one. Uh, at ease, everybody. Now, where's my map? Come on, sir. Thank you. God, it's a barren, featureless desert out there, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> the other side, sir. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, what is this? This is a barren wasteland. Oh, it's on the wrong side. No wonder it's just white. <laughs> it's just a white blank. It's a blank land. Of course I am. Now let's talk about something more jolly, shall we? Look, this is the amount of land we've recaptured since yesterday. Oh, excellent. Um, what is the actual scale of this map, darling? Um... One to one, sir. <laughs> Come again. Uh, the map is actually life size, sir. It's superbly detailed. Look, there's a little worm. <laughs> so the actual amount of land retaken is. Excuse me, sir. 17 square feet, sir. 
<laughs> so you see, young Blackadder didn't die horribly in vain after all. A German spy is giving away every one of our battle plans. You look surprised, Blackadder. I certainly am, sir. I didn't realise we had any battle plans. <laughs> well, of course we have! So the, the gist I'm getting is that he's a soldier in, a, in the army where the people who are in charge are not the smartest and it's just a ploy on how dumb how no, I mean this is obviously probably a part of the show but this is, I'm, I'm sure this General Melchett is a, a very interesting character can't wait to watch it definitely I'm gonna start this weekend though how else do you think the battles are directed our battles are directed sir <laughs> well, of course they are back at are directed according to the grand plan would that be the plan to continue with total slaughter until everyone's dead except Field Marshal Haig, Lady Haig, and their tortoise, Alum? Tortoise! <laughs> Great Scott! Even you know it! Uh, uh, bolt all the doors! Hammer large pieces of crooked wood against all the windows! This security leak is far worse than we'd imagined! I was wondering whether, having been tortured by the most vicious sadist of the German army, I might be allowed a week's leave to recuperate, sir. Excellent idea. Your commanding officer would have to be stark raving mad to refuse you. Well, you are my commanding officer. Well? Can I have a week's leave to recuperate, sir? Certainly not. Thank you, sir. Oh, <laughs> good luck to you all. Sorry I can't be with you, but obviously there's no place at the front for an old general with a dicky heart and a wooden bladder. By the way, George, if you want to accompany me back to HQ and... Watch the results as they come in. I think I can guarantee a place in the car. Oh, no, thank you, sir. I wouldn't miss this show for anything. What is I'm he talking excited about? as a very excited person who's got a special reason to be excited, sir. <laughs> OK. Well, chuff chuff then. See you all in Berlin for coffee and cakes. All right, then. There is Advanced War Tactics. Blackadder. I'm pretty excited to watch this show, you know what I'm saying? And, uh... I saw the poll. I'm work. I'm working on the Idi Amin history biggest villains right now. Um, I saw some comments about y'all wanted something about like Fred, Fred Rose West, and Harold Shipman, and I actually have been watching those type of videos, and I've seen that Britain, like the UK, has they have a lot of uh, serial killers. So you know, if you ever want me to, if y'all want me to do like profiles on them, I mean, not like super detailed because I'm not going to disrespect the victims like that, you know, but like, you know, a synopsis of who they are and maybe what they did. I mean, if you, if, I mean, I could start a separate channel for that, but if you want them on here, you can let me know. Um, thank you. I really appreciate you so much. I mean, you know, I'll probably put a poll up. I'm probably going to put a poll up to be honest, but, uh, just stay on the lookout for a community post, but, uh, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Um, Leave a like if you enjoyed that. Subscribe button if you're new to the channel. Um, I'm out. Peace.